It's my privilege to be here this evening uh, to welcome him into the pantheon of death greats, number five, the great Jason Kidd. <laughs> Great night here at the Barclays Center as the Nets retired the number of one of the greatest players in their franchise history. Number five is up in the rafters for Jason Kidd, now the head coach of the Brooklyn Nets. Hi, I'm Dexter Henry for Nets Daily, and we saw a ceremony that was tremendous, honoring a future Hall of Famer and a player that always was about team. And we saw that tonight when Jason Kidd had a chance to thank people he made sure to thank his teammates that got his number up in the rafters here at the Barclays Center. And I'm very thankful. I want to thank the Nets organization for giving me that opportunity. Um, also, I would like to thank my family, but this isn't possible if I don't have my teammates. And uh, when I go up there today, I take my teammates with me. And uh, I've only known one way to play the game, and that's hard, but I can never play by myself. And uh, I would like to thank my teammates, and hopefully you guys understand when we go up, we all go up together. Something that happened before the game that maybe personified Jason Kidd's mindset towards team occurred in the pregame press conference where he was asked why he was having his jersey retirement in a preseason game and not a regular season game. Kidd responded by saying, when do you know somebody has their jersey retired and then immediately has to go to work after? Well, that's what Jason Kidd had to do tonight and that shows the mindset that he has thinking about this current Brooklyn Nets team and where he wants them to go is he did not want this to be a distraction during the regular season. Now, as far as this Brooklyn Nets team who won tonight here against Miami, had a chance after the game to talk to some of the players in the locker room and ask them what they thought about seeing their coach's number go up in the rafters here at the Barclays Center. It, was, it shows a lot of, um, a lot of class in the uh, Nets organization with, with uh, uh, hoisting this number up and uh, showing their appreciation for Jason. Um, I'm, I'm glad to not only be of a part of this ride, but uh, to say that I was here for that. Like you watch a player his whole career and I really did watch him almost his whole career I was five years old when he started out so um but you, you can't forget how good they really were and then they show a couple clips and you're like man he made some, some shots not looking at the basket he has some passes that no one else has ever made there have been some great passers and players in this league and then they put up the numbers and um it, it's a reminder like it's, it's Jason Kidd and he's good but you, you forget how good like um, so it was special to be here for that. You know, to me, I said Jason's one of the greatest players. I mean, he's the best player. Just He's broken my heart a couple years in a row when I was in Boston in the playoffs. And uh, he, he was just unbelievable. I was a triple-double. At that time, I just never seen him being on the court of playing against a player like that. Or just like you feel like there was nothing you could do. And that's the feeling he gave me when I was out on the court. And uh, it, it was just a pleasure. You know his, right, you know his number was definitely going to go up somewhere where uh, – and it's here. But uh, he's not only one of the greater Nets, uh, greatest Nets to play, he's one of the greatest players in NBA history to play. All in all, as I said, it was a tremendous night here at the Barclays Center. Nets fans have to be excited to see one of the all-time greats, definitely the best player in New Jersey Nets franchise history. And there's a lot of excitement here tonight to see Jason Kidd's number go up in the rafters. There'll be a lot of excitement starting in just about two weeks when the Nets will have their home opener here at the Barclays Center playing against the same Miami Heat and what is sure to be a big matchup. That's it from here at the Barclays Center. This is Dexter Henry for NetsDaily.com.